going on guys welcome back to new video I'm glad you guys came to this one so you can learn how to digiscope and film your hunts through a smartphone so today is the launch of a new company called all in and they make a brand new digiscoping setup and I'm going to show you guys start to finish how, exactly how to use it and what to expect so let me show you so for those of you who are new to digiscoping with your cell phone what we're going to be doing is allowing you to attach your, your cell phone to your spotting scope so that you can film through it. Spotting scope is actually acting as a lens. Let's get started. First off, you need a cell phone, you need a spotting scope. Let's open up the package and show you exactly what's inside. All right, so here's the box that the product comes in. This is exactly what you'll see when you open the package. You've got your friction fit adapter. This one specific for my spotting scope, which you can read on the inside, Vortex Razor HD. And then this is your magnetic um, cap. This is gonna be a protective cap that will go over your lens. That way you leave the adapter on and you can always have a protective lens. After that, you're gonna remove this foam. You've got a nice professional card with some um, how-to videos, some social medias there. And then that's just kind of separating your adapter to the phone case. So this is a tether for your cap. On the inside, you've got your phone case, mine specific for the iPhone 12 Pro. So right now, All In offers a variety of cell phone cases. So you're gonna need to match up your cell phone with your spotting scope. Um, so again, go to allin.co if you guys ever wanna just honestly get to the website and check it out and see what's available. And there will be more options on spotting scopes coming soon, but let's throw the phone into the phone case and show you guys how this works. Here's your phone case. My phone, the 12 Pro, snap that in and you're set up. So this could be an everyday case. You can use it while you're out in the mountains. And uh, the key to this system is the magnetic attachment. All right, like I showed you, I have the Vortex Razor HD and I have already added the tether onto my spotting scope with the cap. So this is friction, friction fit and custom fit for your specific uh, scope setup. So I wish I had two hands. I'm using my feet down there, but you're just gonna wanna press that on nice and center, and you'll know when it's upright because the logo is gonna be just perfectly straight up. And then the spotting scope uh, lens cover and adapter cover is magnetic. That is the key feature to this product. And instead of pulling this off, what you're gonna wanna do is simply twist it to where the magnets, magnets release and pull it off. All right, so with that said, after that, you've got the cell phone. Couple things to keep in mind for those of you who are beginners to digiscoping. Couple important things are really having your lens centered with the lens on the scope and centered on the adapter. It's very important. You'll know it's centered because you're gonna get a very um, dark black circle around, kind of like a vignetting when you pop it on. But let me show you why this is so easy and effective. One key thing when you're out spotting and you're looking at animals that's quite a distance away is you guys know that any little movement on the tripod you're gonna move the lens off of the object or the deer that you're looking at so that's what this this solves that problem guys let me show you how easy this is I'm gonna move this into the shade so you guys can see my screen a little better and with that still try to get an object which is my archery target in the frame we got a big elk over there now. Okay, check this out guys. So when you have the object found in your spotting scope, typically what you're doing is you're gonna tighten your spotting scope down. You might have it loose enough depending on if you have a good quality head. You might have it loose enough so you can still pan. But the key to it is not moving the scope. So you're gonna take your phone. So you can clearly see what's on the screen. I got the grass there. This is just how easy it is to attach the phone to the adapter. And watch how this snaps on. This is the best feature of this product. Boom. Centered. And if needed, you simply focus it with your phone. Or fine focus it with the spotting scope. This is how you know if you're dead center. You're going to have nice sharp black ring around the edges. As you can see. In photo mode, you can see it even better. And I have some really bad lighting right here. So it's struggling. And then if you want to fine focus it. You can do so right here. 
Another thing I love about the product is it allows you to film horizontally or landscape mode or vertically in what they call portrait mode. But watch how that just snaps right on. You can't miss it, you can't mess up. It's just so easy to adapt. And again, because of the center alignment ring, which is on the back of this, see that circle? That is lining up with this right here. Another good thing about the adapter is it is it is meant to stay on at all times and so they've built it with this nice comfortable rubber inlet um, and that piece is just comfortable against your skin so it does not take away at all from the field of view of the scope so you're going to be able to use your spotting scope as you would anyways with or without the adapter but again <laughs> it's just so easy to take this device i'm going to record this and to show you exactly what the phone screen would see when you adapt this so we're going to switch it over to the cell phone right now and lock it in and there it is in landscape mode or horizontal and again if you want to zoom in past the vignetting you simply just zoom in and then you can find focus it on your phone or your spotting scope whatever is needed so guys i've had this out on many hunts um, used it last fall used it on my hawaii hunt i've captured a lot of cool stuff um, and i'm just excited to to help launch this product the company name is all in the website is all in.co that is just o l l i n dot c o so there's a bunch of cool footage that has been filmed with this product and i'm gonna go ahead and let some of that roll and i'll come back and close this thing out guys Well, you heard it here first, the new standard for digiscoping by All In. The new digiscoping setup is sleek, magnetic, and so simple to use that this is literally for everybody. So it is launched right now. The website is finally live. Um, I put a link in the description box, allin.co. And for those of you who have a Swarovski, a Maven, or a Vortex, go check out their selection of optics. And um, what you're gonna do is select your phone, select your optics and get this sucker to you ASAP. So just in time for fall hunts, I'm gonna be using this all fall. I have been for a while and I'm actually surprised there's only been a few people who have reached out to me like, what is that on your spotting scope? How are you attaching your phone to get that cool footage that you've been getting at long distance? And it's this guys, it's all in. So super happy to be a part of the launch. The entire team and the mission statement and the why behind this company is something I support. So I'm happy to help partnership with them, move forward and get this product out to you guys. So please make sure you check out the website. Go get set up. Digiscoping is fun. It's for everybody. I'm going to have a blast using it and hopefully you are too. And if you do, document some. Share it with me if you get it. I'd love to hear from you guys. Let me know in the comments what you think of this product and if you're going to get yourself one. And until next time guys, we'll see you on the next video.